Bowman here from BW1, and I want to show you a cool Instagram app available for Windows Phone, and that is SixTag. SixTag is a pretty cool Instagram client because it pretty much gives you all of the functionality, or pretty close to all the functionality that you normally see in uh, the official Instagram client. So what's nice about it here is you can see you get your typical Instagram feed that you normally would see. And let's say you want to like a photo, you can swipe to the left to uh, bring up sort of you can hit the heart to like it. You can hit this circle here to share it if you want to social share or copy the link to it. You can add uh, if you want to add a comment to it, you can or view the comments. You can do that as well, too. Go back to the main page here and swipe over and you can actually download it as well, too. Video support isn't downloaded, but you can do uh, picture downloads. But nice thing is that you do get video. We at least can watch the videos, and there is support to upload videos as well, too, which I'll show you how the upload client works in a second. But um, you can swipe back here, it comes back to the photo, but you can also just double tap like that so that you get the familiar Instagram sort of uh, way of doing things. Now, that's pretty much going through your feed, and you can actually, you know, go into someone's profile. You can see all their photos that they have uploaded, and you can see all the stuff that you normally see with most Instagram clients. We can go ahead and hit back here. And now if you see here at the bottom, we can look through our, our menu and you have activity, capture, search, your likes, settings, and about. So if you go in and hit um, activity, it's going to show you people that you're, you know, who you're following, what the things that they're liking and such. And then news is sort of your section where you get all the latest uh, notifications. And there is a live time notification that will pop up as you're, getting, as you're getting likes and comments and such like that. So that will come up. And you can also see that here if you go to the front right here at the top, this little circle up here will also give you a number of uh, notifications that you may have. Now, it does support a, a number of uh, different, um, pretty much the same social networks as well, too. But we'll just go ahead and go through sort of the photo taking process, which you can see here. And it's typical. We'll just use these headphones because they're right here. And if you want to take a photo of it, just kind of snap it. And then you get the same cool filters and official Instagram filters that you want that you see in the official client to use. You can add them as you want to. You can add the blur, add a border, contrast, you can rotate the photo. And if we hit next here, a little arrow over here to the side, you can see the upload screen where you can type in your text and your hashtags if you want to, because we know people on Instagram love posting hashtags. You can add it to the photo map, you can share with Twitter, Facebook, Flickr. Uh, VK, Tumblr, and Foursquare as well too. So if you have Foursquare and you add a location, you can check in basically via the Instagram app. And that'll upload right along with it there. There's also video support. Let's go ahead and, uh, oops, took a picture by accident. So used to swiping like that. You can actually, actually go into this site, upload your own photos as well that are already taken. And you can go into the uh, video portion here and you can take a video and it'll allow you to stop and start so you can do the cut scenes and all those sorts of things that people like to do in Instagram video. Now I think you can record up to 15 seconds of course and if you kind of if you're done there you can hit next. It gives you a bit of a preview of the video and you can hit render and upload. Now when you hit render and upload it doesn't actually give you uh, any of the filter options or anything like that so you have to be kind of aware it's really just uploading video and that's it which is still pretty cool to honestly have to be able to upload video to Instagram and you can actually swap between the front facing camera and the rear facing camera rear facing camera which you can see there you can add flash as well too and you can add um, you can show the grid that allows you to align things up go ahead and X back out of this we will delete and delete that video yep let's go ahead and hit back oh, I guess I already did delete it all right so that's um basically the gist of it, you do you can go into your profile and you can just go into my profile. You can see some of the stuff that I've uploaded, and um, you do see ads running in through here. If you want those ads to go away, you can just hit that. You can tut, tut, hit on the X there, and you can get rid of one of the ads. It's a dollar twenty-nine to get rid of the ads if you want to get rid of them. But you know, um, that's pretty much the your, your, our Instagram client here. It's really cool. You can like I've already been through the activity. Actually, I wanted to hit search. You can search for different stuff as well, too. Hashtags, topics, things like that. And I'll uh, just show you the video will play. Obviously, video playback will work. We'll go to one of my videos just to be on the safe side because sometimes Instagram, you know how people can be sometimes on Instagram. <laughs> we'll go to one of my videos that I uploaded about this phone here. This is the iOcean X7 International Dual SIM Smartphone available in Asia. It has a dual core processor and a 5 inch full 1080p display. We're going to have an unboxing available tomorrow at BW1.com. 
All right, you see there, hashtags, all that support. You can swipe. You can tag people. I can tag people if I want to in my photos. I can like it if I want to like my own. <laughs> you can share this to other social networks as well too. So you get pretty much the full, not the, not quite the full Instagram client, but you get really really close to it, and it's really nice. It's just a very good program to, to to honestly use, and it's the best ones you're probably gonna find on the Windows Phone platform. There's other ones available, but so far this has been the best one that I've seen. So definitely check it out. It's free to download right now from the. Um, from the uh, Windows Phone um, app store, it's it's going to be a dollar twenty nine to remove the ads, and it's called Six Tag. This is Bowman here from BW One reminding you: if you like this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up. It always helps us out. Subscribe to our YouTube page. Connect with us on Google Plus and all the other social networks. The link is in the description. And always remember to live your tech world in high definition. Thanks for watching.